Hello friends, we are here today for another plan with me. We are planning the week of August 23rd through August 29th, which is one of my best friends, Carly from Carly Plans, birthday week. So, very excited about that. I am going to be using a fairly old kit from Sticky Essentials from last year. I bought this and then I bought it from a different shop, so I just had two of them. So this is the most Carly vibes possible and it is Boo Day. So these are the full boxes. Little things, whatever this page is. I've not used a Sticky Essentials kit in a very long time and this is an older format. and this page and then I wasn't planning on using this for Carly's birthday so I didn't buy the fashion girl with the black hair I bought this one with the purple hair but she will work just fine and then I'm doing a mixed metal slash mixed pattern underlay situation we have astronomy in light purple and we have b-day bitch in shattered hollow I am going to be using my caress press inserts and my tweezers here are from Sassy Planner Co. With that being said, I am going to just jump in to the spread and I am going to answer random questions from the internet because that's just what we do around here. Okay. For extra foil things that I am going to be pulling in, let's go over that. I have some corners from my shop that were a misfit that I just pulled for myself. I have some overlays from SPC, header overlays from SPC. Uh, I brought in these black hollow flags. I brought in this 15 millimeter black hollow because I don't have a 15 millimeter strip. Brought in this overlay. These are old black foiled numbers from when I had my Carly bundle literally like a year ago. And frames three and four from my shop in Hollow. So let us begin with this spread. Find the glitter hatters. Here they are. Okay. So I feel like discombobulated today. I don't know what my issue is. My nose is stuffy because allergies fucking suck and then I forgot to take my allergy medicine yesterday morning and I didn't take it until the night and apparently just that tiny bit really makes a huge difference. This paper's like yellow on the back. Weird. Um, anywho, so the first question is, am I a clean or a messy person? I would say I am a clean person. I hate when there's messes around. What is my preferred playing piece in Monopoly? Um, I usually play with a thimble if I'm playing like classic Monopoly. I have frozen Monopoly though, so you know. Honestly, I've only played the Frozen one one time, but the actual Monopoly that I have, it's called the Pink Boutique Edition, and you buy, like, malls and stuff, and it's in this, like, plush pink case. It's very over the top, but I don't even have Classic Monopoly, so, yeah. I didn't have hollow date numbers with the right dates, which is why I'm bringing in the black. I didn't feel like making any because I didn't want to wait for the foiler to heat up. Literally can see where my page was cut off. That's cute. Um, can or do I still play Twister? I mean, I could, but I choose not to. Don't really like touching other people, so seems like not really the game to play. Can I play chess? No. Funny story though, Chris like went through this phase where he was obsessed with chess and he had like a membership to chess.com and he would play chess all the time. But like, you know, like he's a gamer type of guy. I've never seen this man get so infuriated about a game 
like he did with chess. Like, something about chess in particular would, like, made him so irritated that he had to, like, unsubscribe and delete it because it was just causing him too much anger. You know, chess, very angry game. Okay, let me figure out my full box situation. So, I already used two, so I need seven more boxes. So, we're not going to use her. One... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And how many do I need? Nine, eight, or, seven more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Wait, one, two, three, four, five six and i'll use her seven okay i don't want to use the cat i don't like cats at all <coughs> oh my god i hate that i literally fucking hate with a passion sneezing not a fan at all okay I'm going to put the green apples over here. They're like on a page by themselves, so I don't want to forget them. Okay. Start with the good old hollow. Shattered hollow is literally like so nuts looking. zoomed in more than this while I'm doing the base? No, I don't think so. I don't know. Something seems odd today. I'm having issues. Please ignore me. I'm not sure that this light purple is really the best option. It does not particularly match very well, so wouldn't really suggest, but and I know that there's some gold elements in this kit, but colors like this are more cool tones to me, so I just prefer using hollow or silver. Like, I would never consider using gold with this kit. Next question, though, is, um, do I prefer straight or bendy straws? I have zero preference. Have I ever entered a talent contest? I won a hula hoop contest once at like some school function i don't think that really is considered a talent though but it happened and i got a t-shirt um and did i win yes i won the one the hula hoop situation do i like poetry not particularly, but like my favorite author is Ellen Hopkins and all of her books are written in poetry. So I guess maybe slightly I like poetry, but I wouldn't like pick to like read a book of poetry, if that makes sense. Like, yeah, like rhyming poetry. I know that not all poetry rhymes, but overall am i a bad loser no i've mentioned this in i think previous videos but my sisters are really bad loser so growing up it was like you almost preferred to lose because of the tantrum she'd throw if she did lose you just didn't want to deal with that so that taught me to be a good loser because that was a no from me This over here yeah yeah i want to do the cheers witch on carly's actually work actual birthday which was tuesday <laughs> next up what's my favorite type of pie pecan pie is my favorite type of pie which i think is not like a popular opinion so Look at me go. Me and Sandy Cheeks. Pecan pie. Oh. What is my worst, my most used phrase? Pr 
probably I'd rather die. What's my most used word? Probably fuck if I'm being honest with you. Who would I want to play me in a movie of my life? I would probably pick Rachel McAdams just because like I've gone my entire life being told I look like her. So if other people think that, I mean, I don't, I mean, I'll take it as a compliment. She's beautiful, but I don't really see it, but you know, what would my dream job be? Probably like a travel vlogger. How long does it take me to get ready? If I'm doing my hair and makeup, 10 minutes max, maybe more like seven. What do I think the greatest invention has been? Hmm. I don't know, microwave, because I'm fucking lazy as hell. Indoor plumbing. You know. What song do I hate the most? Um, I don't know if I have a particularly least favorite song that, like, I just hate. I'm trying to think. I don't know. I can't really think of one particular song that I just cannot handle. Um, what's my favorite feature on the opposite sex? I don't know. This is going to sound weird, but like my mom used to always say that like I always date guys with a big nose. So apparently, you know, that's just, I love me a guy with a strong nose, apparently, according to her. Who's my favorite comedian? Um... I don't really like watch stand up. Like the only stand up comedy I've really ever watched is Bo Burnham. But like comedy actor, probably Adam Sandler because we have the same birthday, which I think is quite cool. Okay, I do think it's cool. I think he's cool. I literally, I was saving the fucking box to put here, and then I didn't do it. Why am I like this? Literally was saving the Cheers Witches box to put on her real birthday. Why? Why do bad things happen to me? Okay. Sure, that's fine, I guess. Move in to the bottom Owashi. What is my favorite board game? Um, I do quite like Monopoly. Um, board game, board game, board game. I have an entire closet of them. I don't feel like I have one favorite. I feel like it changes. Like, I really like Villainous. Chris and I got this game called Horrified. That's really fun. I like, like, more card games, like Cards Against Humanity. Always a fun time when you have, like, friends over. I have, like, this really old version of the newlywed game that I love playing with, like, <laughs> my sister and, like, her girlfriend and stuff. You know. It's fun. It's a fun time. Do I have any lucky items or traditions? I don't have any lucky items. I have plenty of traditions. I don't really get how they go in the same question, but the first tradition that pops to mind is my mom passed away on November 14th, and my mom's favorite thing in the entire world was Christmas. Like, she would decorate for Christmas around, like, before Thanksgiving so that her decorations were up for, like, the whole holiday season. She's like, Thanksgiving's part of the holiday season. I want to be fucking holly jolly. So, it is tradition for both my sister and I that every year on, like, her angel anniversary, we decorate for Christmas and get pizza 
to because that's her favorite food to celebrate her it's like my number one tradition also christmas eve tradition my dad buys us christmas pajamas and then we go over to his house and we watch the christmas movie called annabelle's wish which nobody in the world has ever heard of besides us i'm convinced if i bring it up to anybody they're like i don't know what the fuck you're talking about and so if you know what Annabelle's Wish is and you've seen it and you know what how fucking hard it slaps, comment down below and let me know because we are officially best friends as you are the only person I know with actual taste. Okay, that looks really pretty if you ask me. What am I superstitious about? Um, not really anything. It's like a joke between Chris and I, where like I say that his uniform when we're working on like orders is that he has to wear like sweatpants. Cause like he's the person who will just hang out around the house in like jeans. Not like jeans or like khaki, but in like khakis. Like fucking why that's so uncomfortable. And whenever I'm having issues with my machines, I swear to God, every single time he's wearing his, like, not, we call, we call like, our pajamas, like, our comfortables, his, our comfortable clothes. And he's always in, like, mad, mad uncomfortable clothes. And I'm like, yo, motherfucker, you're ruining everything. Get in your comfortable clothes. So then he changes, and I swear to God, every time, shit starts working. Also, I grabbed the wrong type of pen for this spread because her paper, you have to use, like, a pen. You can't use a Sharpie, and it will probably dry out your pen. So, use a pen you don't care about because you probably won't ever be able to use it again. It's just how this, like, thick-ass mat is. And I used to buy sticky essentials kits all the time but i actually don't like this newer paper i know she switched to just glossy so i'll have to try that out because this like really thick matte was just not my favorite because it's so damn thick oh god this bitch be way too big this box is not going here To be fair though, I don't really use a lot of half boxes in my spread, so. And this kit comes with about 6,000 of them. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. That's going bad. We're having a bad time. Bad things are happening. Ah! No. No, 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 no. Let's get this girl on here because bad things are happening. I don't have any Augusts to put up here at the top, so I guess it doesn't matter that she covers all the way. I ran out and didn't care enough to cut more. I'm a lazy piece of shit. Okay, I'm going to pop on the deco and all of the overlays, fast forward through that part, and then I will zoom in for the day by day.
I die and I do have to show you. Look at that sparkly hollow, or the shattered hollow. Shit is nutty. Okay. So, we are going to get into the day by day. My Mondays are always jam packed with lots of shit. So, I do also hate her little things. They're very thick. I think she's reformatted all of these issues, but I am not sure. So I do have, I'm gonna mark payday. I have this sticker from a shop that is no longer open, but I did think matched pretty well. So I did pull a couple from them this week. And then I do have a payday script in hollow from my shop. <coughs> and that is in um, hollow. Then I'm gonna take another little thing to mark that my electric bill was due this day. And I have a like light purple money sign from SPC along with a custom national grid sticker from my shop in font choice five. Then <clears throat> this also marked two weeks until my Disney trip. I gotta make sure that I can fit all of these little things in here because like I said they're quite large in comparison to most shops I have skinnier ones I don't know why they're so thick overall not the biggest fan I'm gonna pull in a gray like regular little thing like you see the size difference I'm just gonna feel like layer it a little on the header I'm let me know down below as she changed her little thing size to like standard because not a fan of this so I have a little Eeyore I don't really know where that's from I think pretty sheepy and then a two weeks until Disney and hollow from SPC and then we did stop at the post office to drop off orders and got McDonald's breakfast. The envelope is from Carly Plans. You can use Hannah 15 to save 15% off along with getting my freebie. And this McDonald's Happy Meal is also from Carly Plans. So again, if she has something on sale already, you can just put Hannah in the notes to sell her and you will also get my freebie. And I do have a McDonald's script in Font Choice 1 in Hollow. Let us move on to the second portion of the day. The first thing I want to mark is that I did a lot of filming this day. I literally filmed for like five hours. It was nuts. I was filming my scrapbooking videos and they took a while. So I have this camera here from That Planner Girl along with a film script from my shop and font Choice 5. And then I went to the grocery store because for some stupid ass reason, we like didn't go over the weekend. We were like, yeah, we don't really need groceries. Bitch, you needed groceries. What the fuck? So I'm going to put this in here to mark that. And I do have a grocery cart here from Scribble Prince Co. in the light purple foil. And a Wegmans script from my shop in Font Choice 5 in hollow. And then... Chris and I have been like taking turns picking different movies to watch in the evening and it was my pick this day and he makes me watch movies I don't like most of the time so I returned the favor by picking nothing but chick flicks so we watched Just Like Heaven which a bunch of you did guess I did put the picture of it me watching it on my Instagram story when I watch throwback movies I like doing that and a bunch of you did guess that one Moving on to Tuesday, this was Carly's like actual birthday, so I want to mark that a wee bit bigger, I think. I'm going to use this box to mark it. I do, I was planning on using another box that size, but I won't be able to fit it with something in the middle because these boxes are gigantic okay so for Carly's birthday I have pink balloons here from Carly plans to mark that she turned 30 how cute and then I'm going to mark that my car bill and car insurance were both due this day 
I have a car circle icon in the purple foil from SPC and a custom car slash like insurance from my shop in Font Trace 5. And then Chris and I went to the New York State Fair this day, which was not the best to say the least. I did not feel very well. You'll see why in a moment. But I don't really have much to mark that with. So I'm using this like flat lay of fries from Carly Plans because I don't know, you get a bunch of fucking fried ass food. <sighs> okay, and then on to the second part of the day and the main reason I was feeling like dog shit. I got my period this day. And for me, this is too much TMI, but I just really don't care. When I get my period, I get really, 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 really bad cramps. And my period only lasts like three days, but it's a terrible three days. And day one is like not a good time. And so walking, and my cramps are always like in my thighs. So walking around in 90 degree heat, dehydrated, was just not the move. So I have this pad sticker from Carly Plans along with an Amp Flow sticker from my shop in Font Choice 4. And then I'm literally just gonna pop this in here because that was me majority of the evening laying there dying or at least that is how I felt next up um yeah I'm gonna use this Chris and I went to the mall because he needed shoes and shorts for our Disney trip didn't really have either that <laughs> We're gonna work his shorts don't fit right and he doesn't have any like walking shoes so me and use his shopping bag from carly plans to market that shopping and then we watched a movie when we got home which was my pick and i picked walk the line which most of you nobody really got the only one who got it was krista from camry plans very good movie okay on to good old a wednesday I started, I pulled out like our suitcases and started packing because I just had shit that like I didn't want to wear so that I could pack it and it was just all piling up and irritating me. So I threw it all in my suitcase. So I am going to be using a old suitcase from Carly Plans. These aren't in the shop anymore, but she does have other suitcases you can purchase. And then I did go out to lunch with my cousin, which was really, really nice. It was nice to see her. I hadn't seen her in quite some time. She's pregnant now, so that's fun. We got Mexican food, so I'm going to use, oh my God, this box. Next level crooked. Why didn't anybody tell me? Oh my god. At least it pulls up off the underlay easily, unlike the actual paper. I can't tell if that's better, but I'm going with it. I have this like chips and dip sticker from Fruity Sticker Co. And then I had to call Disney because, like, I wanted to make sure that our magic bands were linked and like it showed mine and it showed that it was linked and it did not show like Chris's and so like I went to link it and it just kept saying like this magic band is already linked but like it wasn't showing it and then I wanted to also make sure that we had the magic express booked but the website wasn't working so I was just on the phone with Disney for a bit so called them that those mini ears are from Carly Plans and then on to the second half of the day. My anxiety was really bad this week. I think it gets that way when I have my period. So I'm just gonna pop this in here. This is from Inspire Ever After. And it just says, not today, anxiety. And then I did do some work this day. I think I was working on Advent stuff. So I'm gonna pop that in there with this character and a work script from my shop and that's in Font Choice 1. I'm switching it up. And then the last thing is that we did watch Rogue One this day. It was technically like still my pick, but Chris really wanted to watch Rogue One. So I was like, whatever, it doesn't count as either of our picks. It's just like a random movie we're watching. So I do have this Stormtrooper icon to mark that. 
and that is the first half. On to Thursday, I slept in, which is always nice. Who doesn't like to sleep in? I have a little pillow here from the Fruity Sticker Co. along with a sleep in script from my shop in Fontrace 5. I went to Target this day, don't know what for, even remotely, but that's is okay. I'm gonna use a Target icon from Carly Plans and a Target script from my shop in Font Choice. That's in two. Um, that sticker was from an old foil bundle, but you can still get the script in the shop, just not in that color. And then I did more advent work this day. Pop the flag in there. And I have a laptop here from Crafty Planner Co. And a work script from my shop in Font Choice 1. And then my anxiety was really bad this day as well. So I literally forgot to pull a sticker, so I'm just not going to mark that. Okay. So that happened, and then I had a good old YouTube binge this day. So I'm going to mark that in here. And I have a movie clapper icon from my shop in Hollow, along with a YouTube binge script and font choice 4 from my shop in Hollow. And then, oh, this was my pick. I picked watching Kung Fu Panda. I love that movie. Chris had never seen it, and he really liked it. He rated it an 8 out of 10, which is very high for him. He's very stingy on his rating system, so that was exciting. That TV is from Carly Plans. Moving on to Friday, I made breakfast this morning, and as you guys know, when I make, like, the full spread, I mentioned it before, Chris and I call it the whole shebang. So did that I have in like an eggs and bacon in the light purple foil from Scribble Prince Co and a custom I made myself in font choice 4 that says the whole shebang thought that was cute and then I did some more working this day I have this gigantic laptop from Fruity Sticker Co just so the colors matched well and a work script from my shop. Oh my God, I just ripped my paper in Font Choice 5. And then I had a YouTube binge again. Does this fit? Sure, why not? And so I'm going to mark that exactly the same way with the movie clapper icon from my shop in Hollow and a YouTube binge script in, apparently I grabbed a silver one, don't know why, there she is, living her life. Um, I filmed this day, I don't know what, but I filmed something. Oh, I filmed a haul clip because my fucking shirts for Disney finally showed up this day. I have a camera here from Carly Plans along with a film script from my shop in Font Choice 5. So this day I got really irritated. So Chris and I usually go on a date night on Sundays, but he was having a colonoscopy on Monday. So he had to do like the prep shit on Sunday. So we cut it basically. So we were going to go on our date night on Friday. So we decided to go to P.F. Chang's whatever we were there for two hours because our server just like disappeared it was not busy nothing it was just a nightmare so i'm using this takeout chinese like food box from stick or scroll prints co and i'm just marking it with piss the fuck off because i literally we did not get home till after nine o'clock it was so annoying and then after dinner i was like "Ooh, i could go for a little something something so i went to auntie ann's and i got cinnamon sugar pretzel bites with like the icing to dip it in oh my god it's so good so i have a hollow pretzel icon from my shop to mark that on to saturday very jam-packed and i'm gonna have a hard time fitting it because the boxes are huge in this kit um, I'm going to use this to mark that we did laundry. Hopefully I can fit three little things with that. I have a like laundry 
sticker, a detergent sticker from Carly Plans with a laundry script from my shop in Font Choice 5. And then let me just make sure I can fit all these stupid ass things. Yeah, we should be good. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. I marked laundry smaller than I did in, like, my everyday planner. Okay, so first things first is my HelloFresh did come this day. So I have this food delivery box from Carly Plans along with a HelloFresh custom from my shop in Font Choice five and then I grabbed Chick-fil-A for lunch so I have an SPC doodle of a Chick-fil-A bag with a Chick-fil-A script from my shop in Font Choice 5 and then we went grocery shopping this is a grocery cart icon from my shop along with a Wegmans script from my shop in Font Choice 5. Then on to the second half of the day I have run out of page flags she does have some of like the boxes they're kind of gigantic but do what you can with what you got, I suppose. So I'm gonna pull a purple one of these in. And I have this character from Whimsical Cat Studio on a laptop to mark that I was working on orders. I'm a work script from my shop in Font Choice 3. Then I was watching Hunter Hunter this evening while working on orders. So I have this character again, this is from that shop that it has since closed with a Hunter Hunter script from my shop. This is in Font Choice 1. And then I was just like really, really, really sleepy this evening. So I'm going to mark that I was tired as fuck. I have a Scribble Moon here from Carly Plans along with a Tired as Fuck script from my shop in Font Choice 4. We will move on to the last day, which is good old Sunday. I'm gonna mark that I did sleep on in. Freaking washi strip, go away, go away. I have an Ellie sleeping from Crafty Planner Co. A little purple blankie and a sleep in script from my shop in Font Choice 5. And then I just like literally spent the whole day working, like the whole morning after that because I didn't get to work on orders on Friday because of that fiasco with P.F. Chang's. I'm gonna move this down a little. Okay, so I have another one of those gigantic laptops from the Fruity Sticker Co. This one's in black and a work script from my shop in Font Choice 5. Then down here, I filmed my melting basket. So I have this like gray little thing and I'm gonna use this heart-shaped wax melt from Scribble Prints Co. and a film script from my shop in Font Choice 5. And I watched more Hunter this a day. <laughs> okay, gonna pop this in. And I have a TV icon from my shop and another Hunter um, script in Font Choice 1. And then I talked to the phone with my sister for a bit this day. So I'm going to mark that as well. I have a phone icon and like the purple foil from Scribble Prints Co. And a with sis script from my shop in Font Choice 2. And then, last but not least, I watched a bunch of Face Off this day because I have been re-binging it. I have a TV here from the Fruity Sticker Co. along with a Face Off custom I made myself in Font Choice 1. And that is everything. Um, I'm going to fill everything in and then I will zoom out show you the finished spread of what I have left. <laughs>
Okay guys, this is the finished spread and I think it looks literally stunning. Um, what I have left over that I will be de-stashing, we have some scroll principal foil, these two boxes, one of each underlay, these pointless, pointless bits, some washi and some date covers, a bunch of stuff from this page, a handful of things from this page. I barely touched this page, just the flags and one label. I only used the labels from this page. Most of this page is gone. And I literally used one sticker off of this page. So that is everything for this spread, guys. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you did not, then give it a thumbs down. Either way, you're helping out my channel. Comment down below, subscribe if you have not already, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys.